Yo, what up everybody? It's Martin here and uh, today I'm going to show you how to do some delay throws. Basically adding echo to only the words that you want um, in a song. So let's go ahead and listen to the hook I have here. I don't want your bitch but best belly she choose. Grab her off your hands if you snooze you lose. Fag her with a foe, bitch I'm feeling loose. Cool. There it is. Now what I want to do is I want to add echoes at the end only on the end words like if you snooze you lose 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 da, na, 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 na. so this is how i do that okay so you got your audio track right here and what you got to do is make a new auxiliary track and when we, you make the aux track you want to name it delay and you want to solo save that delay by pressing command or windows solo see how it grays out there now we need to feed the bus. We need to feed this ox. So we're going to feed it with bus, uh, I don't know, 5960. You can choose any bus that's free. Now I have the auxiliary set up. I have the input set up, but I don't have the audio track sending to that auxiliary. So now I'm going to go to my sends right here. And then I'm going to send out to 5960. Okay, so now this fader right here that pops up, you see how this is highlighted white? This fader controls this bus send. So every time I go like this with the fader, it's going to send to the delay. So check this out. Oh, actually, first you need to put a delay plug-in on the, on the aux. That's the most important part. Duh. So now I got the delay plugin set up. I'm going to set it up for quarter notes and kind of low pass and high pass filter it out. So now every time I send this fader up, it's going to send to the delay. Check this out. I don't want your bitch, but best belly she toes. Grab her off your hands if you snooze it loose. Bag her with a fuck. So that's pretty cool. There's too much echo, so I'm going to turn down the feedback to where he's only saying it twice. And I'm going to take out some more low end to go for like a telephone effect. And now the next step is to, you can kind of feel it out and listen, and but I like to get right to work. So I put this right in touch mode, which means it's going to write automation. Now anytime you touch this while the song's playing, it's going to record that. And I can click on my delay level to see. Oh, that's a different send. This is 5960. See, it's all the way down. Now watch this when I record the automation in. I don't want your bitch, but best belly she toes. Grab her off your hands if you snooze it loose. Fag her with a foe, bitch, I'm feeling loose. Bopping on these bitches, duck the goose. I don't spit no game, bitch, I don't seduce. If I'm on the beat and he produce. Talk. All right, so there it is. I mean, these levels are signifying when the, de when the audio is going to the delay and that's why you're only hearing the delay on the last words so that's the most efficient way to do delay throws in certain places so i hope that video helped you guys out you know it's pretty simple process you just set up an aux put a delay on the aux change the input of the aux then send the audio to that aux and then automate that um, auxiliary send to only go on the words that you want. Um, and that sums it up. So thank you guys for watching. I hope this has helped. And I will see you guys soon.